Let's go in. We're at um, Nunham Massey National Trust. It's um, hundreds of years old. That's got to be a few hundred years old. There's Maria and the girls over there, look. Zoom in. I need that thing, that gimbal, Tony. What Tony's got, that gimbal thing. Did you see the days at the beginning? It's having a bit of renovation, look. Conservation specialists. They must be doing a bit of renovations. I'll show you when on the way out because uh, it's a last minute thing. It's not far from where we live, this Garrett, Durham, Durham Massey. About 15 minute drive, 20 minutes. But it's, um, I've just got here and the, the car park closes at quarter past five and it's eight pound an adult to get in and six pound a child. And the woman said to me, Go on, you've only got an hour and a half left. I ain't going to charge you. So I said, look at the Irish. Yes, that's the old pump wheelhouse, but they must be doing renovation works on it. National Trust. Yeah, there's a day there. Here's the day, look. Hey. Coming in, the day's.
few more there, look. A nice place, isn't it? I used to bike it over here when I was a kid. It's an old building. Look at the Irish. Juanita. You see the days? Look. Santa Claus is reindeer. This used to be somebody's house, this place. I'll show you the house in a minute. And the gardens. Where is it? Uh, Dunham Massey. It's about a 20 minute drive from where I live. So that's the, that's the house. It's sort of obviously some wealthy person owned this land in that house. And I think the Nat National Trust. Um, the National Trust took over it. Well, that, that was just an house where one family lived. I don't know what flag they fly in there, Tony. It's not Italian. So this is it. This was his house and gardens. I'll have a walk over. I know there's a lot of day shit about. Hey. There's Maria. There's Maria and the girl. Look. Got all the deer crap on the on the lawn. You wouldn't like them on your front lawn, look. <coughs> There's the super girls. There's the super girls. Have you seen the cows? Over there. Mom, come on, let's not Look, there's loads of deers over there. Look, here's another. I'm uh, getting you a look at this house. This was uh, somebody's family's house and gardens. I think there's a sign here, might tell us. So the um, slave trade, the statue was, there was a statue stood here, but they removed it because obviously whoever owned this house and, and land, it must have been a slave trader. Oh, that's the sign, that, that sign there, there was a statue there, probably of the guy, he was obviously a slave trader. There we go. 
Oh, you can see it. So that flag is uh, Emperor Isla Selassius. That's his flag that they're flying uh, from Ethiopia. He spent four days here in June 1938 at the invitation of the Temple of Stamford, Roger Gray. He was an exiled head of state, Roger Gray. That's probably him there. So, anyway, it's owned by the National Trust now. So it's owned by the National Trust. And um, like I say, it's, it's massive, absolutely massive. You can spend all day here. But we, the last minute thing that we've come out. But it was good. So I've saved 16. Eight pound an adult, 16 quid. These restaurants and all that there, as you can go for a meal in there, in these old buildings, look. The old stables, Tony. You're talking, looking at hundreds of years old, these buildings. So you can actually go in the house. So the house. Open 12 till 4 pm Monday to Friday. Servants courtyard 12 till 4 Saturday, Sunday. So we're just a little bit late, really. I think it's uh, still open. So I can, I'm going to go in anyway and have a look. Look, look at the old history, a lot of history here, eh? Well, this is the back of his house. There's the servants' quarters. Can I come in here? I'd oh, have got it blocked off, look. Look at this old, some of the old furniture still here, Tony, look. Look at that piece of kit. Is that a pulley? Oh, that's the pulley system for the washing line. So this was the servants' quarters, must have been. Look at this old oven. Look at that. Some money in that old thing. A couple of bed chamber pots. Bit of the old brass thing. They've only walked. So this was the servants' quarters, look. Still intact as it was. A bit of natural history here, Tony, look. There's the washing machine, look. Beat, beat them clothes. <laughs> Get that for an old pot. Fire, fire pit. Oh, the old, yeah, still here, look, made of timber. This must have been where they've done all the washing, the clothes, and pots or whatever. Ooh. Look at the windows, look. Still the original windows. Stone columns. And lead. Look at that for a door, Tony. Solid oak. Old cat. I'm not, sure, I'm not sure I'm supposed to be in here. <laughs> but yeah, I just come through the gate. That's roped up, you see, going upstairs. You could probably go upstairs. You can actually go into the house and that when they have it open. I better get out anyway, because I, I come through the gate. 
I don't want to get kicked off site. Old clock tower. So you've got restaurants up there, you can have a meal, stables. Where's the super girls gone? Even the old cobbles are still down in the yard, look. You can imagine, can't you, coming through there on horseback. Hey. Okay. Imagine it. Look. So I bet this was an old carriage house back in the day. There it is, look. There's the old cart. The wash. That old cart Tony. Like an old like an old trotting trap gathered. What the old tinkers use. <laughs> yeah, the wash it's called, look. Originally built in early 1700s as a carriage house. By 1878 this space had been converted for brewing and an associated bakehouse. So, it was built in 1700s. Wait a minute, America wasn't even thought about then. Look at, look at, this, look at the detail up there in the monks. How old it is, still standing today. Don't build, that, don't build them like that anymore. Eh, don't they? They don't build them like this anymore, kid. Look at that. They're now owned by the National Trust. Do I want an ice cream? No, I'll have a, an ice lolly, please. An ice lolly, but I don't, not a chocolate one or anything with ice cream in it. Get a proper ice lolly, orange one or something. <laughs> so, the little mick gets everywhere. Oh, well, there you go. That's the old wash. We call it the wash. For whatever reason, must have washed the carriages here or something. Let's have another look. Wheat beer was safe for the most water and brewed, and the brew house was key to any large household producing the main stable drink. Floors and walls were removed to accommodate what would have been large vessels opening in the walls, were also probably to do with the brewing. But the exact purpose is now unclear. In the 19th century, it fell out of use and became a store until 1907. Uh, converted in the 20th century, the unusual double light wash still retains original fittings, including the huge water tank located just under the roof line and associated pipes for drainage. A wash was essential for maintaining cars, given the shocking state of English roads at the time. So that's the water tank there up in the rafters, but. There you go, there, there it is, look. So that's been up there since the 1700s. Look at that. I'd like to get that down, Tony, and weigh it in. It's made of lead. See, it's made of lead, that. Be worth a few quid. Look, there's the old original pump. Look. Still got the handle on it there. And uh, that's the tank up there, look. Did you go in the uh, servants' quarters? And there they are, look, eating ice cream. Where's mine? I did, I said I'll have a lolly, ice lolly. Oh, you have got the ice lolly ice cream pile. I see what I mean. Look, I've got an ice cream, Dad gets nothing. <laughs> Dad gets nothing, look. No, you didn't ask I said an ice lolly, orange. Oh, yeah, see what I say? See, she's saying there wasn't any... You tell me an ice cream place that don't sell ice lollies. No, it's an ice cream parlor. No, no, no. They have an upstairs. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
if you go through that gate and go into the old servants' quarters, all the original stuff there, look. Yeah, old original car. This was the 1700s it was built. Okay. If you go through that gate, I've just been inside there in that building. In the... Um, Immigrants. What? What did you say? The servants' quarters. So this, the guy who owned this was a slave trader. And that, if you read that sign there, they removed his statue. So you could go in there, that's the courtyard. I've just been in, I just pushed the gate open and went in, but you, four o'clock. Oh. So I've, I've just been in there, but you look through the windows, you see all the original stuff still there. Oh, that's where I've just been inside. See. It's blurred, they can't see it. They've seen it, have been in there. Are we allowed to go in? Yeah, the gate's shut. I've just been in. You just go through that gate and turn left, it's open. Seventeen hundred, Stoney. I think that was when America was only just being developed on it. Look, the old entrance. You've even got a water bowl and a tap for your dog. Look, you can bring your dog. See, the, there's a moat round the front. Uh, come here, you fucker. There's a dinner. There's a dinner, Maria. Hey? What you looking at? There's Donald. No, I'm all right. They did an ice lolly and a bad one or a drink. Go and have a coffee, yeah. Cap, cap, yeah. Imagine owning all this lot. Got it. Who's in there? Let's have a look. Sorry, I've not shouting anybody out. Oh, it's Craig and Robert. Bit of history here, Robert. Done on Massa. Google it. I think, I've just, what I've just been reading, it was um, owned originally by a slave trader called Roger Gray. And the uh, emperor from Ethiopia, Ilis Elasius, stayed here in 1937 for three or four days. The size of the place. I remember when I was younger, I used to bike it over here with my mates in the um, in the summer holidays. Morning. You get your later. Ice cream. <laughs> I don't, um, I'm not a big fan of ice cream, to be honest. But because um, of this heat, I'd have had an ice lolly. But I don't like it with, with the ice cream in. Yeah, so over there, got the Canadian geese chilling under the shit in the shade. Then you got the, uh, the, the reindeer over there, or the fellow deer, them. So this is all part of his green, would have been his workers, or cottages. For his, for his staff, probably. His groundwork is absolutely huge. You can see the, uh, the deer there.
A lot of history here, Robert. A lot of history. Well, like anything the National Trust are involved in. Now it's every bit of, it's always packed. So it's eight pound an adult and six fifty for a child to get in. And I think to enter the buildings you can go round all the buildings. I think it's twelve fifty for an adult and eight eight fifty for the kids. But because of the time I turned up, I never paid a penny. I tell you what though, it's, it's absolutely scorching when you're out in the sun here now. What's happening to the weather? Here they are. The super girls. Any? Oh, there's all the deer. Did you see the cows? No. I want to milk the cow. She wanted to milk the cow. I to milk the cow. Too hot in that sun, isn't it? Yeah. Too hot when you stood in the sun. Where's the cow though? Yeah, but it's massive there. That's what I'm saying. You play like this, you have to come here early in the morning so you can walk all the grounds. Don't you remember coming here, me when you was a baby? We brought me here before, before Lily was born. That was in that was in Tatton Park. What oh, was that Tatton Park? I can't remember. It's a similar thing. Tatton Park's a similar. I don't know. The, It was over there, wasn't they, Mia? I think they're over on the other side of that building. Hello, ladies, says Craig. Hey, Robert, pass me your gun. There's a little grey fucker over here. You see him in the grass? Pass me your gun, Robert. A grey squirrel. There he is, look. It's absolutely huge. It's on the other side of the wall down there, that's all the set the land. You can walk it all like. You need a full day here. Look at all the squirrels there on the wood long. Pop, 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 pop. There used to be actually, I remember years, when I first, ever first came here, going back in the 80s, there was red squirrels here. But these American, buggers come and wiped them out. The Americans were imported from America, weren't they? The grey. And they come over and wiped all our, our um, red squirrel population. The American grey squirrel. Some of them though, I've got a touch of red in them. So maybe they, they have bred, interbred. Walk a bit further down. Good eating if you have a few, but it's not it's not squiddle hunting sea season.
It's actually um, trying to get you a shot over the wall. You can see how extended it is the land that he owned, this, uh, whoever he was. Well, the house, the house itself says it all, isn't it? Just the house alone. Never mind all these other outbuildings and coach houses, stables, uh, where they used to brew beer. Because apparently back then, beer was safer to drink than water. Anyway, Maria's got me a coffee now, so there's the deer on the move, look. Pass us your 2 2 rifle, Robert. We'll have one of them for dinner. Boom! Oh, they're going through the uh, coach house entrance, look. See them. Time is it? <coughs> That's a nice one, the, the one at the back. It's a nice colour, a very light colour. Should have brought. Um, I'll have to get one of them gimbals, Tony. They have them in Louisiana. I think I'll get one of them. Uh, them gimbals, Tony's got. Give you a bit of a steadier shot. It's no good after a night on the whiskey. Venison. Yes. Yeah, I thought they were Santa's helpers them day. Reindeer. There's Mia sneaking up on me. Oh, there's me, Maria down there. I'm dehydrated. Dehydrated? Yes, I'm going to faint. Well, I thought, why didn't you get a drink when you was in there? Oh, I Do you want a drink? Yeah. Do you know where to get it from? Yeah, there, boyfriend. Hey, who's, uh, who's giving me hundred dollars? Don't need to do that. A hundred? How much is that? Like, eighty quid? Yeah. Whoa! Get some 1700s food. <laughs> Thank you very much, Robert. Robert gave you that. Oh, wow. Right, do, you want a, do you want a drink? You go and get, get Lily one as well because you know what she's like. Uh, you know, let me get some dollar out. <laughs> Pretty expensive, isn't it? How much is it? It's like £2 for one scoop ice. Yeah, there, when you come to places like this, they double the price. I just use Mum's card. Do you want is it me? cash or card? Both. Alright, yeah then. Alright, you stay there then. Get Lily one as well. Yes, thank you very much, Robert. Appreciate it. Never hide, Maria, says Roberts. I told her she can, she can, she can milk my cow, Tony. It's nice sat here though, in this, um, in the shaded area. It's a nice breeze coming in from over there. I think it's actually 31 it's reached today here, so that's got to be a, over the 90s.
So it actually are yeah, listed, obviously, this conservator there and a bit of work. I know over there where I went earlier, I might I walk down there in a minute and show you that's the old, um, it's like a, a wheel in the water house, you know, an old pump house. What are you saying now, Maria? Come over. I went, no, I've just said, Mia's just gone to get a drink from the shop. She's thirsty. Happy ending, yeah. Oh, you know, you found them now, the cows, have you? I'll uh, just wait for Mia coming back. Because she, she's going to come back here. Otherwise, she'll think we've left her. What, keep your eye on the time, because they've locked the gates at uh, quarter past five. Morning Kennedy Supergirls from Craig Jacob. <coughs> they went over there somewhere. And they found the cows. There's Mia now coming through the arch. Yeah, I think I'll get one of them um, gimbals and and do a few visits of these. I'll come in. I'll come here again with a gimbal, but I'll come in the morning, so I'll take you inside the old because all the old equipment's still in the rooms and everything. It'd be worth you seeing. Take it. Take you in and and do a live stream and then there's another one Tatton Parks the same another big country manor you I didn't drop it you did <laughs> <laughs> your mum said she's found the cows Bless you. where are they over there so yeah I'll do that because I know some of you, you especially you American guys you like the old British history and buildings like that. Old houses. Old uh, Lord of the Manor's places. Well, like you say, it's just the, the filthy rich and it's always, that's always it, the way it's always been, isn't it? Probably some government, something to do with the government. He was. Ninety-two and raining, really. Mind you, that happens, doesn't it? When it got gets that hot, they have um, storms, then, don't they? Where was the, where were the cows over there, Mia? Yeah, they went that way though. Anyway, let's have a little walk back over there. I'll show you, just in case you missed it, if I wasn't, you've only just come in. What time is it, Mia? It's quarter to five. All right, so we've got half an hour before they lock the gates. <clears throat> yeah, there's a, here's an earth being used, probably a badger. That's an earth. Probably see, see the clean soil outside. So they've got a badger set on, on, on the property as well, look. Do another one See, there. See the dirt, that's how I know it's a badger because they clean them out, they clean it out every day. Fresh soil been took out. That's his bolt hole, that's his escape route. Years had to go to put the Lakeland Terrier down there to snip it out. Robin Hood, yeah, I'm thinking that, Robert. 
Robin up, Robin Hood country. Oh, Where? Hang up there. Ah, she scared him now. Where's the gun? So having um, a bit of work, conservation work done on this old, I think it was a pump house or something like that. I know there was an old wheel in the, um, well, you see the water system. Look at that squirrel there. There he is, look. He's only a baby. That's a little one. They're not good eating. We're not the mad good eating. Where's the other one? Oh, I see her. Who? Hey. So they're doing a bit of uh, conservation work on this. You can actually go in there, I've been in there before, but obviously not now while they're doing this work. There's, um, I think it's on the other side, the old wheat water wheel. Go and have a look. Badger's good eating, but isn't it a bit, isn't it a bit, isn't it a bit chewy? There's a girl. Yeah. Where is it? Down there. Oh yeah, I've seen it before over there. Yeah, just what I see if I can show these, the uh, that water wheel. Obviously there's a, a waterway there. You can hear the, you can hear the water running round there, it's round there. That's the old wheelhouse, water wheelhouse. That needs all cutting back, but you can actually see the water running through under the under the bridge, under the road there. Uh, Ah, you want me, you want me to come no, seen it before. Down there, water. No, it's yeah, that's water. That. I want to see the cows again. There was five cows and it died. How many cows are there? More than. So that leads right up to the, the, the place there. Mum, see the blue flag? Oh, the sun's shining on me. Good for you. See the blue flag? Where? That's a dragonfly. It's blue. Yeah, it's blue. Another, another land, another big house over there. Look, that's all part of it. This, this property. See it. Yeah. There's the waterway. Look. Oh, that's a, looks like a bull over there. Look, Maria's trying to catch fish, look. Mia, that's, that's full of cattle piss. <laughs> that's, where, that's where they clean the cattle out. It all goes through there. You're putting your hands in it. Yeah, the cows are over the wall here, yeah. Is 
Look at that. So this is all part of the same National Trust land now. This is only 15 minute drive from where we live, Robert, this place. 15, 20 minutes maximum. Here we go, here's a bit of, here's a bit of beef. It's a bit of beef, look. It's only young ones. Got all the flies on his nose. Bull over there, not very old. I walk back round again and uh, show you that big house again before we go. Yeah, there's the water wheel. You can go in there when it's done, when they finish doing whatever they're doing. Probably just see it in there. Hi. Hello. Okay. Definitely need a gimbal. that little truck It's warm in this sun here. Get in the shade. Yeah, 
nice trees then. Uh, you won't go hungry here, Robert. Eh? They're everywhere. Eh? You won't go hungry here. Look at that. Oh, it's an electric van. Mega. Electric vehicle. Did you see inside the uh, thingy before? Them days are the same as well, look. Amma Pibesans. What's that mean, Robert? Sure, have you seen this before, Robert? I'm not sure because I didn't see you when I was in here. The old wash house, the old water tank still there, as it was in the 1700s. Look at the, uh, the pegs there holding them together. Oh, the bells are ringing. Oh, anyway, it's warm. Oh, somebody's lost the hat. 
there's a coming through, look. There's a coming through. There must be, um, behind them doors, must be the old carriage houses. Where's them girls? Uh, they've disappeared too. My battery's going. See where they are. I go, the, the oldest one. Five hundred years old. English, English heritage there uh, for you guys. They must have gone without me. Time is it now? Where are you? They're uh, closing up now. That's where you, you can probably have a meal in that restaurant there. Closed it off now, they've just, they've just put that gate across. Uh, 
are these things here, these fly, are these fly traps. Show you. Yeah, they're fly traps, aren't they? See it. Yeah, we've got our, uh, what time is it now? Because they're locking, they're locking the gates here. They're locking the gates, it's closed, the car park closes at quarter past five, it, they lock it. Fly traps. I can smell, I've got a smell of a vixen then, a fox, probably in the grass somewhere here. You know the smell. There's one, look. Yeah, no problem. Five, yeah. Edward, come on, quickly. <coughs> now, please. Eight pound a person. Four, four quid for kids. But obviously, I, I arrived there at uh, quarter to four or twenty to four, and they said we ain't going to charge you. Go and have a look round. But well, you're better off coming in the morning and spending the day there. This car park would have been chocker, but obviously, hey, there's Maria's car. I didn't, I didn't leave that there. She must, have, she must have been out here. Uh, you know it's our car. Look, Got the Union Jag. I love Manila on the back. I've left this side window open. Where are they? Super girls. Hey, thanks for that uh, earlier, Robert. 
quick look at your messages. Well, that's it. I didn't know. I thought I was I was going to pay because I said where do we pay? She said I'm not, no. She said uh, it shut. The car park closes at quarter past five, so basically in just over an hour and a half. So we're not going to charge you. That's why. Uh, look at the Irish. I think Robert. Don't mention it, no I won't. Well thanks anyway. It is. Yeah, that's I think they do, you know, Robert. I think they do in the restaurant because um, I seen one of the fingers before and he was dressed in like old you know, the old traditional eighteen hundred clothing. They probably do. Uh, but next time I come, I'll come early, and I'll go. I'll do the house, the full tour in there, where it's all the original stuffs in there. So we'll uh, we'll do that here. They are now. Look, so you can see it. In, I'll do it live. But when I do it, I'll get one of them gimbals, so it's nice and steady. Anyway, guys, I thought I'd give you a quick live so you could see it. So anyway, we're going now. Right. Well, thanks for uh, dropping by. Hey, Dennis, you just missed the um, bit of English heritage. Um, I won't delete it, so you can, if you want to watch it back, you can. Yeah. Too hot. Yeah. Too hot. Right, guys, I'm going to end. Thanks for tuning in. I'll, uh, see you all again soon.